Assemblywoman uh, Louise uh, Gomez Reyes uh, for having the courage to take the leadership to name Dolores Huerta de Muchas gracias, Louise, and por todo su liderazgo. And after she did this in uh, after she did this in California, uh, they were followed by Washington State and New Mexico, uh, who also have now named Dolores Huerta Day on April the 10th, okay? <laughs> so we have other states. Uh, and, and you know, I, I just want to say to uh, everybody here at the school and our principal, our wonderful principal, that uh, this school is uh, really in the forefront. The vision of having an international school uh, at a time when we, we really need it the most. Uh, we know that there have been many, many great uh, achievements in science. We recently heard about how they have uh, taken a picture of the black hole in the universe. And we think of uh, the internet and our computers and our cell phones and everything. And we have all of these achievements in science, but we are so far behind in our country and in our world when it comes to people, you know? So, sabemos que hemos tenido muchos logros cuando se científicos en nuestro mundo. Muchas cosas en el universo tenemos, hemos mandado personas a las diferentes, a la luna y tenemos todos estos logros. Pero cuando se trata de los logros de la gente, estamos muy atrasados. I just came back from a conference in uh, in Texas, and the conference was uh, it was a three day conference on the issue was racism, and I was there with Reverend Andrew Young, who marched with Dr. Martin Luther King. Uh, he was just Martin Luther King's one of his right hands, and that this is what the whole conference was about. So I I think that what you have done here with the school to make it an international school to make it bilingual is a giant step uh, towards getting rid of racism. But I think it's also something that we really need to address. And I really need to understand that we are one human race. And there is no place in our lives or in our society for racism. So, acabo de venir a una conferencia donde estaba con la persona que la mano derecha de Dr. Martin Luther King. Esa conferencia se trataba del racismo. Y se me hace que es una cosa que tenemos que tratar uh, porque no debemos de tener uh, ni uh, campo en nuestras vidas ni en nuestra sociedad para el racismo. Y es una cosa que tenemos que empezar todos a trabajar para eliminarlo. Uh, and uh, one of the ways that I have been saying to people that we get rid of racism is to remember that we are one human race. One human race. We don't have a lot of human races, we only have one human race. So, un modo de que yo digo que tenemos que tratar el racismo es tenemos que aprender que somos solamente una sola raza humana. Tenemos muchas culturas, tenemos muchos grupos étnicos, pero solamente tenemos una sola raza. So we have a lot of different ethnic groups, a lot of different cultures, but only one human race. So, and, and when I say this, I like to remind people that our human race came from Africa. Tenemos que acordar, acordar lo que nuestra raza humana vino de África. Eso quiere decir que todos somos africanos. What that means is that we are all Africans. As we are all Africans of different shades and colors. Somos africanos y tenemos diferente uh, piel de color diferente uh, uh, pelo de color, pero somos todos africanos. So, let's get, quiero pedir a todos, I'm going to ask everybody, all the children over there, I want you to hold the hand of the person next to you. Hold the hand of the person next to you. Todo, por favor, please, everybody, hold the hand of the person next to you. Hold the hand of the person next to you. And please say to that person, hello, relative. Hello, relative. Hola, dígale a la persona, saludos a mi pariente. You're a light-skinned cousin. Okay. And we know that as a family, as a family, we have to protect 
no tenemos que apoyar. So as one human family, we know that we have to support each other and we have to care for each other uh, because this is the way that our human race has survived on this planet. Because if we love each other and we care for each other, then we will not have any hatred. Uh, we will not have any hatred in, in our hearts or in our thoughts or in our words. So, si nosotros como una sola familia nos vamos a apoyar, no podemos tener odio en contra de cada uno. So, les quiero dar las gracias. Okay, thank you very much for holding hands. <laughs> And so we also have to work very hard uh, to make sure that these children, these children here will be able to have a free college education when they grow up, okay? Tenemos que trabajar para que estos niños, no solamente algunos de ellos, pero que todos van a poder ir al colegio y que lo pueden hacer gratis. Y que lo pueden hacer gratis. And uh, we are not going to take no for an answer. When they say that there's not enough money, we are the richest country in the world, and we will find the money. Cuando dice que no, que no hay bastante dinero. Estados Unidos, somos el país más rico en el mundo. Hay el dinero, pero nosotros lo tenemos que encontrar, y las personas que son los ricos lo tienen que pagar para estos jóvenes, ¿ok? Para ellos. Sí se puede. De las voces de los niños, ¿ok? From the voices of the children. From the voices of the children. So, in order to make that happen, we know we have to continue uh, to work very diligently to make sure that we are all involved, uh, to make sure that we elect good people, uh, not only to Sacramento, but to the U.S. Congress and to the presidency. And we cannot, uh, we cannot uh, be lax on this. This has got to be a very, very concerted effort. We've got to put a lot of energy into making this happen. So, si queremos llegar a ese punto, Tenemos que trabajar duro. Tenemos que no tenemos que involucrar, no tenemos que ser ciudadanos, tenemos que votar, tenemos que elegir personas, no solamente a Sacramento como nuestra compañera, nuestra líder Eloise Reyes, pero también al Congreso de Estados Unidos. Y sí lo podemos hacer. <coughs> tenemos los números, nomás nos falta la gana, ¿ok? Nomás nos falta las ganas. So les pido que se comprometan y que vamos a ayudar. Otro punto más, uh, va a llegar el censo en el, mil, uh, en el año próximo 2020. Vamos a necesitar la ayuda de todos ustedes para que toda la gente se cuente en el censo. Y no podemos esperar hasta el año que viene, tenemos que empezar ahora. Porque por cada persona que no se cuenta, vamos a perder más de 10 mil dólares por persona. Así que les pido por favor que empiecen a correr la palabra, que que todo el mundo por favor que se que nos ayude para que toda la gente se pueda contar en el censo y no solamente que vamos a perder dinero para esta escuela para nuestra comunidad pero también vamos a perder la representación de personas como el Luis si no nos contamos ok so now we just say the other thing is that we're going to have to get everybody's help uh, for the census in 2020 and we cannot wait till April of 2020 to make this happen. Uh, we've got to start getting the word out to everybody right now that you've got to be counted because for every person that is not counted, we will lose about $15,000 per person. Money that would come here to this school, money that will come to our community for health services. So we've got to start telling our neighbors, our friends, please get counted because we don't want you, we don't want this community to lose money because you were too lazy or too afraid to get counted. Can we do that? What do we say, se puede? We have been told 
all the children here are telling us what we have to do. So I want to thank them very much. And again, I want to thank the leaders of this wonderful uh, uh, school here uh, because what we heard uh, with these children, they were so articulate. Not only did they speak English, not only did they speak Spanish, but they did it in a very beautiful way with beautiful diction. And that's what we want. We want the best quality that we can have in our education system for all of our children. And so I'm going to end now, but again, I want to thank everybody uh, for, <coughs> for having the celebration. And uh, before I, I leave the podium, and I, I try to do this everywhere I speak, because, you know, when people talk about my work that I did, <clears throat> I like to remind people, it's not about Wonder Woman, it's about Wonder People. So I stand here on the backs of so many people, of farm workers, community members, with my foundation, the Dolores Huerta Foundation. We're trying to stop the school to prison pipeline. Uh, we want to make sure that all of our children get a quality education and that uh, we really make uh, that dream of equality uh, for all of our children, that we make it a reality. So, cuando dicen, bueno, cuando me alaban por el trabajo que, gracias a Dios que estuve bendecida para participar, siempre quiero decir, no se trata de una sola persona, se trata de toda la comunidad, de toda la gente, porque sabemos que trabajando, trabajando juntos es como podemos ganar. So no se trata de una sola persona, pero de todos, uh, todos nosotros juntos trabajando. Y les voy a, les voy a uh, hacer un grito, les voy a pedir un grito, y uh, ahorita para terminar. Y el grito que les voy a decir, les voy a, pe uh, les voy a preguntar, ¿quién tiene el poder? Y quiero que ustedes digan que nosotros, pero en inglés. Y cuando diga qué clase de poder, el poder de la gente. Pero quiero que lo griten muy recio para que los racistas... Y esas personas que están en contra de nosotros para que nos escuchen. So, I'm going to ask all of you, I'm going to ask you all, who's got the power? And I want you to yell, we've got the power. But when I say it, and then I say, what kind of power? You say, people power. But I want you to yell that so loud. So all the racists, the homophobes, the sexual harassers, the misogynists, the climate change deniers, and all of those who are anti-working people, that they can hear us, okay? So children, I'm gonna ask you who's got the power, and I want you to say, we've got the power, okay? And when I say what kind of power, you're gonna say people power. Okay, are you ready? Okay, let's go. Everybody, shout really, really, really loud. Who's got the power? We've got the power. What kind of power? People power. All right, so we do it one more time? Even louder, one louder. Okay, let's go. Who's got the power? We got the power. What kind of power? People power. Okay, so are we going to go out there and organize, make sure that we will fulfill the dreams of the children here at this school and every school in the United States of America? What do we say? ¿Se puede? Sí, sí se puede. ¿Se puede? Sí, sí se puede. Okay, everybody together, let's go. Si sí se puede, 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 si sí se puede. Muchas gracias, muchas gracias por acompañarnos este día. Thank you very much for being here with us today. Thank you.